You think most guys on OnlyFans are happy? I just gave you a study that that proved that like they haven't. I just increased. don't believe that study for a second. It seems like the biggest BS ever. You also didn't believe that eighty nine percent of subs are married men. I don't know what to tell you. Like, where where's the study that's coming from that's showing that all these men are being happy on OnlyFans? I, Every single only fa- do you have met who subscribes to OnlyFans looks like they literally want to kill themselves. Well, hold on, but that's because you're explicitly a dating coach yeah. who those types of men are going to, right? You're targeting the outliers who are already striking out. That's why they're coming to you, right? All right, Far, would you say, okay, here's answer this question brutally honestly. Would you say that, uh, how, how many subscribers do you have on OnlyFans? I'm not saying. Okay, whatever, let's just assume it's a thousand. How many, what percentage of your OnlyFans subscribers are people you would actually meet up with and hook up in real life? I don't know, it's possible. Zero. <laughs> I go through my Instagram DMs for dates. That's not zero. zero. The answer wait, wait, wait. is zero. Wait, wait, wait. That, that's, that's kind of the point that I'm trying to make, is I think that the expectation needs to be, it is none. There is no expectation. Now, it is possible that you are charismatic enough with the waitress that she's like, mm, yeah, and she's into it. And that's fine, but that most people know that that's the rarity. I don't want men going into this being like, God damn, if I riz her enough, there's a chance. I think that that's the area where, again, most men are informed enough to know that that isn't a chance. I'm concerned about the small population that are at higher risk. No OF creators are leading men on in that sense. Like I lived in an OnlyFans house for six months. I met like 30 new creators a day. Not a single OF model is ever saying like, there's a chance we'll meet up. Are you, are you kidding? I'm sorry, that is a lie. <laughs> that is <laughs> not, that is not she true at all. She meant most of them don't do that, okay? <laughs> okay, okay. The whole premise <laughs> of OnlyFans is leading guys on to no, thinking. It's to give, they have, it's to give an internet relationship. What? Most of these guys aren't going to actually meet up with them because like I said, they're married. Then they're why is there a dude in it. India texting them instead of the girl? What, how does that relate at because all? Because the guy thinks that he's building a relationship with a girl, but he's not. He's building a relationship with, yes, an with someone who lists 20,000. They're not 000. saying we're going to meet up. Right, but do you think that if that guy knew he was texting the Indian, that he would actually be engaging and sending him dick Honestly, pics? Honestly, I do. I've seen really? Dr. Phil specials where they bring on guys, and they're okay, like, this so tell, is the model you should tell who's been scamming you, and they still continue to talk to the scammer. Because they like the intimacy, just under the image of the model. Yeah, but women go back to their abusers. That's a terrible argument. I'm not going to go down that route. I'm not saying it's good. He's just saying what they do, and I'm saying I think they still...